Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. So if you are new here, hey, my name is Kim and I go around every single week to stores like Marshalls and TJ Maxx and we look for high makeup at discounted prices. I call this series Budget Beauty Buys and it is so much fun. I love taking you guys shopping with me. It is a huge part of my channel and I know a lot of you guys come to my channel for the series which is really cool. So today we're going to hit up all the stores and I'm hoping to find even more new stuff today, more holiday collections. We've been finding so much good stuff these past few weeks. So today I want to share with you guys something that is going to be so amazing for your holiday shopping. It's not a sponsored video, which means I'm not getting paid a sum of money to mention this brand. But what it does mean is I'm an affiliate with a brand called Fetch. And basically what it is is if you sign up using my link, I do get a small commission, which if you guys use my links for things, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. Being YouTube and Instagram, labor of love. So when you support me by, you know, signing up for things and stuff like this is really no cost to you guys. It's actually a way that you'll get money. Fetch is actually an app that I've been using for, I want to say over a year now. It is one of my favorite apps. I love sharing with people because all you have to do is you take your receipts. It can be any receipts. I snap a picture of the receipt. And then what happens is those receipts turn into points and those points then turn into gift cards. And I know when people first hear this, they're like, no, it can't be. You guys, it's 100% legit. It is a completely real thing. And you do look at gift cards just for snapping pictures of your receipts. There's no gimmicks or anything like that. If it was, I wouldn't share it with you guys. And I absolutely love it. I think I'm up to like 150,000 points right now. And every time I get a receipt, gas, grocery store anywhere I've even used receipts from the when we went to the aquarium like for my birthday any receipts you snap them and you get points there's also extra bonus points so sometimes they'll do like specials say you buy something from like once I had Vaseline a Vaseline product I got it at Dollar Tree that gave me like 5,000 extra points and I was only shopping at Dollar Tree and it works for every store like I said even Dollar Tree everyone gets really excited when I say that the receipts from Dollar Tree work on fetch and sorry this is long-winded, I just want to kind of explain to you guys how it works. So if you sign up with my code, you are getting, I think it's 3,000 bonus points. In my way, I just double-checked, it is 3,000 bonus points. They have so many stores where you can redeem your points. Literally every store, they have TJ Maxx, they have Marshalls gift cards, Dunkin', Starbucks, Amazon, Sephora, Ulta, literally every single store that you can think of. They even have restaurants, they have airplanes if you want to use your points to get tickets or put it towards tickets it is literally so cool and you're not paying anything you really don't have to do anything except scan your receipts absolutely love it so many of you guys especially on instagram have signed up with my link and you love doing it too and something i actually like doing is when i go to the store like target and people leave receipts behind i'll actually scan those receipts i don't know if that's allowed but i've never had an issue um so i'm kind of saying that like off the cuff <laughs> but anyway i can get extra points right so if you guys want to sign up with my link there's no code it's just my link I'll take you to download the app on your phone why not have an extra way to get your coffees every month. I mean, I think that's pretty awesome. Get an extra thing at Ulta, Sephora, just for scanning receipts that you would just normally throw away. You can also add your email and put your online receipts in there as well. So it is a win-win situation. So it will be linked down below. Go check it out. It is so easy to use. And receipts for up to two weeks. So just make sure you don't let the two-week time period expire um, or else you can't scan them. But I think two weeks is a pretty fair amount of time to scan. So without further ado, let's get on into shopping at TJ Maxx and Marshall. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not yet. Turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on my videos and let's head to the stores and see what we can find. First up, I found tons of Beach Cosmetics brush sets this week. This one looked like a collab. It was the 1991 brush set by Alicia Marie for $7.99. And you'll see I later find a palette from her as well. I found this Laura Lee Los Angeles palette. There was no box or anything, but I love this palette. And then I also found the BH Cosmetics Eye Essential brush set for only $5.99. And I'm still finding the Catrice setting sprays. I really love these. They're only $3.99. And I just loved these little under eye masks from the Crumb Shop. 
you guys know how much I love my Dash waffle maker. So this snowflake one is a must have for the holiday season, only $7.99. They also had just this regular one. Um, this one was a little more, it was $9.99, but I like the ones that have the little designs on them. Next up at Marshalls, I found this Anastasia kit again. It's the matte lipstick set. More BH Cosmetics brushes. This is the Rose Quartz brush set for $12.99. BH Lavender Luxe brush set. This one was really pretty. This was $14.99. I found so many of these, you guys. The Morphe 9J, just a crush palette. I had never seen this one before, but it was really nice with some pink shades. This was only $8.99. Then I found the e.l.f. Mint Collection. This is the Mint Melt Face Primer. You guys, this was so cool. I know a lot of people love this and say it is a dupe for the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer. So just giving you guys a little close up on what it says. It has a vanilla mint scent. And then this is only $3.99. Keeping up with the theme, I found the e.l.f. Mint Melt Eyeshadows. These were $2.99. I was so excited to see these at Marshalls. These are really cute. I also found the Milt Melt No Budge Eyeshadow Stick, so it's basically just an eyeshadow smudge stick. No price on this one. I also found the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Dew Primer. This is another very famous product from e.l.f. So this was another crazy find. Um, this is Skin Loving Ingredients. This has niacinamide. And I also want to show you guys, if you have not tried this Laura Mercier highlighter yet, it is amazing. It is such a natural, gorgeous glow. It is only $12.99. Highly recommend. I found these last week, the BH and Mrs. Bella Lip Gleams. These are lip glosses. There are three shades in total. These are $3.99. MAC Prep and Prime Lip Base. Becca Light Shifter is now on clearance for $10. This is a finishing powder. Beach Cosmetics Ultimate Matte 42 Color Eyeshadow Palette. This was only $14.99. I hadn't seen this Cara palette before, but it was really pretty. It was called Sweetest Treat, and that was only $8.99. I also found this one that I had never seen before. It was called Across the Rainbow obviously very colorful and fun here they are side by side pacifica crystal rays luminous setting powder this is actually on clearance for only four dollars next up the anastasia loose highlighter haven't seen this in a while this was 6.99 and the shade was peach i think it was peach fizz is the shade it's like an ambery orange color this is a new find from Cara Beauty. It's the Bronze Goddess Highlight and Bronzer Palette. This was only $7.99. So you get six shades in total. BH Cosmetics Blushing in Bali Highlighter Palette. This was $5.99. And this Authentic Skin Finishing Powder from Zoeva is actually on clearance for $4.00. I found this gorgeous packaging from Makeup Revolution. This is the Amethyst palette. Look how fun that is when you move it back and forth. And this was only $7.99 from XX Revolution. They have a couple different lines. I can't believe this was still here. This Jouer Blush Duo for $9.99 in the shade Passion. I found this last week. Tons of Makeup Revolution. You guys know the drill. I find so many of their palettes at my stores. This is the little mini black pearl palette. Seriously, how do they keep up with all their launches? This is new from Rude Cosmetics. It's the Moon Smut, weird name, highlighter, loose highlighter. Reminding me of the Wet n Wild one that I got from Dollar Tree. This is new also. It's the Pacifica Ice Baby Highlighter. It actually comes off with a pink tint. It's like one of those kind of duochrome highlighters. This was $3.99. Lime Crime Wet Cherry Sweet Matte Eyeshadow Palette. Really pretty like pink tones for $9.99. I had only seen this once, this one time. Here is the BH Cosmetics and Alicia Marie 1991 Eyeshadow Palette. So I'm assuming this is supposed to be like a grunge kind of throwback palette. This was $8.99. BH Cosmetics Mrs. Bella Shadow and Highlighter Palette. 
I think I have found this before. From Rude Cosmetics, I found the cutest little 70s themed palettes. Look how fun the packaging was. I loved the 70s outfits. These were $4.99. Each one had a different color scheme. So cute. I love 70s themed items. These were $4.99. Duo. This is the Mind Trap Colorful Large Eyeshadow Palette. I haven't seen this also in a while, the Lime Crime Venus XL palette. This is like colors that I love. This was $24.99. This BH Cosmetics Spotlight Highlight Palette. A lot of you guys told me that you loved this palette and it's really pigmented. It's only $6.99. Next is the Revolution and Tammy X eyeshadow palette. I always love the packaging on this one. It's only $7.99 great price for such a large palette this oh my gosh it's been a while for this the Anastasia powder contour kit $16.99 haven't seen that in forever cover effects custom enhancer drops from cover effects did I say that already <laughs> this is in blossom it's like a kind of like rose gold goldish shade and then I found these Cara palettes I'd never seen before this is called girls just want to have sun and these were $8.99. This one was called Summer Stunna. And these are so cute. This was a little bit more colorful. I found this BH Cosmetics Color Lock Matte Lipstick in this really pretty pink shade, Faithful. And then also a lip liner. So uh, tons of BH Cosmetics. They must have had some serious overstock going on. Zoeva Authentic Skin Concealer. I really want to try this. This was only $3. More Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops in two shades, Moonlight and Celestial. I have found this previously at stores in the past. These were $8.99. And this is Moonlight. It is definitely a golden color. On to some skincare. We have the Pacifica Body Scrubs, Lavender Moon and Strawberry Peach. A cute yellow makeup eraser Japanesque makeup brush cleanser I love their brushes so I was wondering how this would be more Japanesque brush cleaner this was only $4.99 this is the paradise gloss from soap and glory $4.99 this is a pixie uh, little kit I thought that was super cute with their glow products for $7.99 this is a Shiseido kit. It was $49.99, but you couldn't open the bag. They probably didn't want people to like take stuff from it. And then just some hair stuff that I found from Briogeo. So that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed shopping with me this week for budget beauty buys. Comment down below and let me know what you found this week, what you bought. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!